Good evening, everyone. This morning, a man was shot and a woman was doused with gasoline after a fight in a parking lot on West Ridge Road. The plaza at 630 West Ridge has a history of having parking lot parties, some of these going back years. So the Rochester Police Department, they are saying the man shot is expected to survive, but for one major business there, they say this is the final straw and they are moving away. Christian Garzone has been on location, joins us now live with more. Christian. Well, Adam, Bathtub Billy's has been here for a long time, but the owner told me today he just can't stay here with these large plaza parking lot parties taking place. It's not only hurting business, but the owner fears the worst will eventually happen to one of his customers. Chaos. That's how Matt Reese, the owner of Bathtub Billy's, describes these parking lot parties, like the one early this morning that ended with one man shot and another woman covered in gasoline. He says for six years, these gatherings have been a nuisance. It's, you know, a few cars at first, they do donuts and they're racing around, and then it turns into about 100 to 150 cars. He says on some evenings, he has to close down his bar at 9 p.m. The area, unsafe for his customers. It's getting earlier and earlier. It used to start around 11.30. Reese says the large group goes to the same four lots in the area every night. They get chased out of one, go to another, then come right back. The objective? You know, what's the deal? What are you guys doing? And they just go from parking lot to parking lot and just looking to irritate the police. That and boredom, he says brought on by the pandemic, something Q Graham, who lives behind the plaza, agrees with. There's nowhere to go, so people's trying to outlet their right. anger and frustration, but I honestly think that they shouldn't do that. Reacting to last night's shooting here, Janice McFadden, who lost a son at 18 to gun violence, is asking those at these parties to stop before someone gets killed. It's an awful thing to see your child in a casket. You know. Reese says the plaza owner has promised to do something to combat the gatherings, added security, police, putting up barricades, but has done nothing recently. It's so bad, Reese has decided to move his business for the safety of his customers. Now, we did speak to the plaza owner earlier. He was at the liquor store. He had no comment and asked us to leave. On West Ridge Road, Christian Garzone, News 8. Adam Marine, back to you in the studio. All right, Christian, thank you.